This video will tell customer how to install and uh, use monitor lava sensor. When you receive the sensor like this, and at first you need to release the band. Okay. Be careful, don't cut the cable, just the cut the back. Okay. And uh, the second step is to mount in the prop to tank, uh, put, put the prop around the top of the tank and uh, make sure the prop on the bottom of the tank. So at first, we have to imagine the cable legs, how long, how long cable will be inside the tank. Now, we have to check the sensor prop uh, to time bottom and the table. This is the landing plan So this time we are in check okay, like this in position. And we are using the table. Okay. Now we started to put the sensor inside the tank Around the top of the tank. The tank top drop the core inside the tank. Until the drop touch the bottom of the tank. Okay, now the drop touch the tank. We are carry it. Okay. Then we are use the screens to tell the blend on the top of the tank. Okay, now the sensor will finish the installation. Then we can continue the next step to connection the cable wire, the cable wires to the power and the controller. Use the follicle and now the product is uh, this is the uh, follicle of uh, the short level indicator. indicator. But this indicator will be uh, input 4 to 20 mA inside a uh, single inside the indicator and then will be display the level here. Also, this is the is the level on the light. This meter will power by two two hundred twenty watt from the power. Okay, you can see the back the back the diaper wires connection. Uh, Eleven port and the twelve port will connect the. 100 to 240 watt your AC and the uh, line and the 10 port will, can, will output 20, 24 watt your DC uh, for sensor power and uh, 20 ports and uh, 24 port will input the for to 20 mA sensor, certainly, uh, because the for to 20 mA signal is a low, low well, low well. So you will need to short connector, 10 port and uh, 40, 24 port. You can see here is a blue well directly connected port 10 and the port 24 directly short connection. This is for 4 to 20 mA connection 
a request. Okay, now first we are can connection the power to the meter. Here it's 100, 200, 20 watts to AC. Okay, this cable is a power cable where power supply the indicator. Then this is the HPT604 model for sure level sensor. This is the short wire. Okay, we have best uh, disconnection. And this is the power We are connection, the port 9, 9 port. 24 watts positive negative okay so next here this is just four to 20 ampere single wells also it's the power zero uh, we need to connection the port 20 because uh, 20 port is 20 port to 20 ampere signal input. Okay, now sensor connection finish. Blue wire, short connection. The port 10 and the port 24. And the 29 connection to sensors radar wires. And the 20 port connector. The green was for 20 ampere output signal input the meter. Okay. Now all wireless connection finish. We to back the panel, the panel of the meter. So we are power on the cable. Okay, you can see the meter started working. Now uh, because uh, we have already configuration the parameters uh, for the sensor inside the meter so it's directly display the water level inside the tank actually when you are first time first time receive this meter you can uh, you, you, are, you need to first uh, setting some parameters uh, inside the meter according to the sensor's specification for example this one sensor is Calibrate, calibrated zero to two meters uh, lower range, lower range, and uh, for two twenty ampere signal output. So at first you can press one hand, short press the first button, and uh, you will see the AOC menu, and uh, display one three two. This is the code. You are continue to long press this button. Well, in the second layer meter. Okay. Now, here display PN 24. It's me. 24 is me 4 to 20 mini ampere signal. Okay, right. This is the DP. DP is mean the December, December port, 3 December port. Okay, this is alarm, alarm, ignore it. Okay, we just need to set address, communication address, found rate, found rate. Uh, this is uh, PB, short. Okay, ignore it, just uh, to check the level range setting. OUL, zero meter, OUH, two meter. Okay, this is the same as the level setting. This is PL, it's mean uh, the pH also. The same with the level range. Single cut, no need to setting. Okay, after you finish the parameter setting, you can long press the button, press the button, and back to the measurement. Windows.
Now it's displayed the single input port to 20 ampere, and the level display is 0 0.83 meters. So you can see the display is very stable. Output very stable. Now we have finished uh, the installation and the wireless connection and the uh, level meters uh, setting configuration and uh, the measurement result. This is all of the introduced about polyphonic sensor and the uh, meter, level meters in mounting. Okay, uh, later I will use the high accuracy controller to display testing, testing particle sensors accuracy and that's reading stable ability. Uh, but first let me try to introduce this controller. This controller with a very higher accuracy permission up to 0.02% for scale virtual range. For example, here is the range zero. I have set set the range to zero, lower zero, higher two meters water level. Okay, later we will put the sensor connection this for sure increase water. Control control the level to the sensor drop. Okay, just a moment. Please remember, I just uh, take out the block from the tank. Before you are checking the sensors, uh, you need to check the diaper if you buy or not. You can open the cover, bleed, bleed cover, and uh, please check the diaper. The sales diaper is fine or not. If it's fine, okay. Cover. Don't use the big to touch because this sales diaper cannot be destroyed or change the shape. Okay, the wire connection, the sensors to the pressure controller. Okay, because you can see uh, the pressure now is zero. It's zero, so the meters is zero. Okay, now we are divided for two meters for six part. Let me check the twenty percent. Twenty percent of the level range is zero point four meter level. Let's control. When I press the control, uh, the sensor will be changed to 0 0.4 meters water level, and here will be displayed the water level at the same time. Okay, you can see. Yeah, yeah, that's it. This is the water level change. Now the water is 0 0.4 meter deep, 0 0.4 deep water level. Here it's displayed 0 0.401 meter. Okay, just uh, one millimeter difference. Now we are changed to the water pressure up to 40% of 2 meter. Okay, you can see the changes of the water level. Also, the clone of the light will increase. Total two meter. Total two meter. Set thirty percent.
with 1.2 meter water level, 1.202 millimeter water meter water. Now the water level change up to 1.6 meter deep. Okay, 1.602 max level, 2 meter. 2 meter water level, water level. Okay, 2000, 2.00, 2.001. So uh, the layer testing of the sensor will just finish. So you can check uh, all the points, like half, 50% will be one meter. green and stable, one meter, 1.001. So uh, at first we are once introduced how to mounting and the installation particle level sensor and the uh, level indicator. Uh, now I just uh, testing the sensor's accuracy, uh, different water level form, and uh, we can find the sensor's very high accuracy and the reading stable. So uh, you can use a uh, hardware sensors uh, with nice and uh, you will be lucky to execute.